Well, during the 2018 Winter Olympics and his 100th birthday, gold medalist Barney Yule was celebrated at the Lancaster train station today, declaring this week as Barney Yule Week in Lancaster. News 11's Taylor Toshif was there for the celebration. It was a triumphant return for Lancaster native and Olympic gold medalist Barney Yule as he made his return home from the London Summer Games, greeted by hundreds of people at the Lancaster train station 70 years ago. Right here in the train station is where there was a huge celebration when he came back from the Olympics. Just days away from what would be his 100th birthday and during the 2018 Winter Olympic Games, the week of February 17th was named Barney Yule Week in Lancaster. That we can call him our home because in this day and age there aren't too many role models that we can be proud of. So I think it's important today that we're here to celebrate Barney Yule Week. While he was breaking records in London and labeled the fastest man on earth, back in Lancaster County he was inspiring those that crossed his path. At first, not knowing she was in the presence of an Olympian, graduate of J.P. McCaskey High School, Lisa Weaver's brief moment with Barney left a lasting impact. It sparked something in me as a human being of um, knowing yourself but not needing to prove yourself. But he was a hero right there, and he had everything he needed to be a perfect human being. Barney's longtime neighbor and babysitter to his children, Betty Hurdle, was also in attendance. He was our action figure. He was our star because he was an Olympic champion. During the year she knew Barney, he was never boastful about striking gold at the Olympics, but is happy to see he is getting the recognition he deserves. It wasn't honored the way it should have been, and I'm so glad to see now with his 100th birthday that we can have this celebration and celebrate him. He would be very pleased. He'd be very humble. Reporting in Lancaster, Taylor Toshev, News 11.